Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 30th, okay? So we know that the timing is fluid, and this reading may or may not be for you, okay? So what kind of message do I have to deliver today? What kind of message do I have to deliver today? Death. Death. Death is an ending, right? It is. It's a profound change. Okay? This is a transition. Okay? It's a transition. It is an ending that leads to a new beginning. Somebody is being left behind. There's a separation. This separation uh, forces a new beginning. The decision is being made. It is. So we do have a major ending here. This ending does lead to a new beginning. Look at the wings. There's some sort of wings here. Whoever is leaving is doing so out of integrity. It's like they know that they can't go through with this. They know that they can't do this. And even though it hurts, they have to go. So it's definitely time to go. Wheel of Fortune reversed. This is a loss. Okay, this is a shocking, unpredictable loss. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that this is happening. I'm sorry that this has happened. This is a setback. This is bad luck. Something not working out. It wasn't meant to be. This could also be the past mistakes that are coming back to haunt a person. This is being at the wrong place at the wrong time. This just isn't the right time. Eight of Swords. Now the Eight of Swords is being confused, being mentally conflicted, staying put, uh, choosing to stay put, choosing to keep quiet. Somebody has chosen. They had. They were pretending. They were, they were choosing for quite some time. They were choosing to stay in a situation that wasn't making them happy. Not saying anything, keeping quiet, you know, keeping themselves confined to this situation. They could have spoken up at any time, but they didn't. They just didn't want to see. They didn't want to accept the truth. They didn't want to accept the, the pain, okay? You know, what comes before the Eight of Swords is the Seven of Swords. There probably has been some deception. There's been some sort of betrayal which has been ignored, Somebody was ignoring the facts, ignoring the truth, ignoring the pain, allowing themselves to be deceived, trying to pretend that everything was okay. But if, they've, if they finally reached a point where they just can't do this anymore, I'm not going to move forward in this situation. So they're putting something to a stop. So somebody has definitely chosen to... Uh, depart okay this is a departure 
So we do have a departure here. After being in denial or refusing to accept the truth for quite some time, there's been a delay. There's been a delay. This person went all the way to as far as they could go, right? Obviously, you know, they, they, you get to this point, you know, th these people at, on this card, they were, they were at the wedding, okay? So somebody has, has gotten to as far as they can go and they get to that point where it's just like, you know, I can't do this. I'm not going to do this. So somebody has decided to, you know, stop something from happening or stop themselves from going down that path. This is not where my future ends. This is not in my future. You know, I'm not going to be. So this is a, this is a stopping something. Something is coming to a stop. Um, somebody has been trapped. They have been trapped, uh, not accepting the truth for quite some, deceiving themselves as well. Knight of Swords reversed. So the Knight of Swords reversed is probably, maybe somebody's even been in an abusive situation, but the Knight of Swords reversed is a dangerous situation. Could be explosive energy here. We have, we have, um... Now the Knight of Swords reverse is, is is somebody that could be getting go doing something um, dangerous. Dangerous. There's some sort of dangerous situation here. Somebody could be unaware as well, or they're just pretending it's not dangerous. Hmm, what is this? What is this Knight of Swords reversed? Looking for a fight, perhaps, or. You know, this is somebody who leads, this is a clueless individual who may lead other people into danger. This person, um, is all tied up. Hermit reversed. This is an unenlightened, isolated, lonely, sad. This could be angry. We may have somebody here that is angry. I'm not, I'm not sure what is going on here, but this person is tied up. This is restricted and this is restricted. So there's some sort of restrictions. Well, we are in some sort of restriction, aren't we? Can't go out. That makes sense. Can't go out. This is, this is, you can't. This is being in exile. Yeah, that's where we're at, right? That is where we're at. We're in exile right now. So this is a dangerous situation. Somebody's in a dangerous situation with another person. Interesting. Can't go out. Can't socialize. What the hell is going on here? Mm. We this could be mental health problems. I'm wondering if we have somebody here with mental health problems. Justice karma. Oh boy, this is fantastic. Not. So this is justice. All is going to turn out as it should. Justice is upright. So this is this is uh justice. This is karma. This is uh consequences. Finality. There's some sort of consequences that are going to be a karmic consequences that are going to be imposed. They're going to be imposed for, uh, this could be abuse. I'm, what the heck? There's some sort of abuse here. This person doesn't care who they hurt, the Knight of Swords in reverse. This is a mentally abusive person who has really hurt, obviously, this person who has been uh, allowing it. 
But this is karma. Justice is a card of karma. It's the laws of karma. Karma and and justice sees sees through the situation. It does. Justice will be served. Mm. Ten of Pentacles reversed. So, ah, there could be some financial ruin here as well. Okay, with these two cards. These are both tens. With next to the death card, tens are completions. We have the end of a karmic contract. Put it that way. We definitely have the end. Somebody is paying a karmic debt. There's a karmic debt that is being paid. Something's coming to an end. Okay? It's very unfortunate. There's an unfortunate ending here. For somebody that acted recklessly, this person was abusive. They were abusive, mentally abusive, verbally abusive. Justice is being served. This is this is complete ruin. Ten of Pentacles reversed. This is collapse. This is a collapse of an empire, a change in the family legacy. This is bad business. Somebody was living beyond their means. They were putting out false impressions. There could be a fight over money. But karma is here to bring balance. This is a card of balance. To balance out the uh, tables, the scales, right? So karma is coming to balance out this situation. To bring balance back to the, to the situation. Somebody's going to lose something. It's just a horrendous loss. I'm sorry. It is. With the Ten of Pentacles reversed and the Wheel of Fortune reversed and the Death card, this is a huge, huge loss. There's been some sort of short-lived success, okay? It wasn't meant to happen like this. It was based on falseness, okay? It was based, based on some sort of false lies, per se. Somebody was, was uh, they abused their power. They did. Hmm. The fool. The fool. We have uh, somebody that endings lead to new beginnings. We have somebody here that is, if this is freedom, they are breaking free. They're breaking free. They're escaping. They are escaping from this mental turmoil. They are escaping from this trap. They are escaping from this prison. This is prison. Okay, this is prison right here. This person couldn't see. They couldn't see that they were dealing with a reckless, rude individual who that was abusive. They couldn't see. They chose not to see. But now, this is like, uh, it's time to reconnect. It's time to socialize. time to come out of hiding. Somebody has been restricting themselves, or they're in some sort of restriction, obviously. Now there's some sort of dangerous situation that has happened or it did happen. Somebody may have acted foolishly, but it's time to let the past go, to leave something behind. Because this is being left behind and this is leaving something behind. So somebody is leaving somebody behind. They're headed in a new direction. They're breaking free. This is freedom. Freedom from um, a uh, unstable, uh, unrealistic, uh, karmic situation. Okay, so we definitely have a new beginning here. We have a new phase that is about to begin and somebody is being called to step forward with blind faith to take a risk. Somebody is stepping into uncharted territory with this fool card. This fool seems to be, the fool seems to be looking at a change in residence. Somebody's moving out. They're moving out. Something could be happening that is bad for business. 
There could be a change in the revenue. Karma never loses an address. So this, this could be a huge uh, loss of revenue, a huge loss of money. Ace of Cups reversed on the bottom. This is shutting down emotionally. This is a this is a very emotional time. Some there's there's there could be some tears that are shed. Shutting down emotionally. We have somebody here that is shutting down their feelings. They're they're choosing to leave. Somebody is choosing to leave somebody. They're choosing to leave. Because they have to. They know that they have to. They know that they have to. It's like they've been living some sort of lie. Because this is a card of lies. Seven of Swords comes. Somebody has been living some sort of a lie. So now they're leaving. They're leaving behind this... Uh, contract. This karmic contract. Starting over. Ready to step forward. Ready to break free. This is freedom. This is breaking free. Starting fresh. Starting with a clean slate. So we do have a new beginning here. Six of Wands. Now this is a this is a hero. The Six of Wands is a hero. This is somebody who has uh, been through some sort of serious struggle and has weathered the storm. Okay, so this is being recognized, being publicly recognized. This is public recognition. Somebody is being urged to uh, go. They're being urged to make a move. They're being recognized. So somebody is being, there's public recognition here. Somebody is being recognized for who they are. looks as though we have somebody here that is leaving, definitely leaving something behind. Okay, somebody is leaving something behind. It's like they're just ready. They're just ready. They're just ready to go. They're, they are. They can't pretend that they are in love with this person. They can't pretend that this is going to work out. They can't pretend. There's something that happens. There's something that happens that uh, it's like it's, it forces this person. It forces this person to to go. Somebody is going to be publicly recognized for their nobility, for doing the right thing. Put it that way. They are. I feel like in the past, they did something that was lacking integrity. They didn't tell the truth. They didn't care who they hurt. But now, perhaps, they're ready. Maybe they've, they've been restricting themselves. Maybe it was out of fear or whatever. But now they're ready. They're, and this is about doing the right thing. Justice is about being honest. It's about doing the right thing. It's about acting with integrity. So somebody may decide to act with integrity. So I feel like we do have somebody here that is about to do the right thing. And they're about to leave somebody behind that they just don't love. They probably built a false foundation. They built, built something uh, that wasn't real. Oh my God. I did shuffle. Ace of Cups is reversed. Is still on the bottom. So this is somebody is leaving a loveless situation. And I think there's going to be somebody. This is a very emotional, emotional, emotional time. I think there's definitely going to be some tears shed. Um, whew. there could be a divorce there's definitely a split or a separation here um, or somebody is you know this is a huge 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 loss put it that way um, three of swords I mean I can't I don't know if somebody, this could even be uh, you know I'm not I don't want to scare anybody but um, this could be this is heart this is with your heart this is heartache heart pain I'm not sure somebody could have a heart attack. I'm not trying to scare anybody, but I'm just that it is the mean, one of the meanings of the card, and we have the death card right here. Something could happen at home. 
or you're just feeling heartburn okay and um, so there's something to do with the heart here there's pain and there's separation and loss so be prepared to uh, be broken free of a situation that uh, was very painful this is painful it is painful it absolutely is painful so it is but this separation um, gives you an opportunity to step into new territory and move forward okay because this is moving forward towards victory puts you in a leadership role somebody is going to take you know the lead they're going to face their fears and they're going to take the lead they're going to they're going to do the right thing they're going to act with integrity and do the right thing and leave behind something that uh, they're not they have been in denial about you know and it hurts so yes this is painful be prepared to hear about uh, something ending uh, there's a like a, this is the death of a situation and starting over um, on the right path I mean I can't it is what it is I think we have somebody here that's about to do the noble thing they're about to do the right thing and somebody's gonna get hurt in the process they're, 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 it's definitely uh, a painful situation. Somebody is being left behind. And I think that uh, it's a huge loss. Good luck. 